It's time for game of the week. This week is on the SP2. Anyway, what's up, guys? My name's Code. I don't know how that's going to end up sounding. It's probably going to sound really stupid, but. It'll be okay. The SP2, Tier 10, Chinese, TD. Rick Rewards Vehicle. And just look at it. This is a beautiful tank. I love it so much. Just boom. I didn't mean to pause that. Oops. This is another game where I really just like, you know, kind of like uh, two weeks ago when I just kind of, they drove out in front of me so I shot them. A lot. So. Target spotted, the T-49 gets spotted and I'm like, ah, no, I'm gonna look this way. We see the Leo. And with the god tier accuracy of the SP2, we're able to hit him. Now, I just do that just to show where the front of his tank is, honestly. And that was a poorly aimed shot. I wasn't really sure about that shot because I thought it hit blind in, in the original, like, end of the game. But, uh, I was wrong. So. But we're gonna smack the T49 there, set him on fire. He's got an auto or a manual fire extinguisher. So we're only able to do 183 damage to him. Now we're gonna we're gonna do something a little cheeky that you can't really even pull off in this tank. Could pull a snipe. A 2684 from 450 meters. It's not gonna work. But I am trying it. Don't know where that shell went either. Um, but we're all good because we're already up to fourteen hundred damage, and it's been two minutes. Obviously, this thing you got to play a little slower uh, due to the just the, the the speed of the tank and the uh, that shot, dude. Uh, the speed of the tank is kind of garbo, and the armor is really garbo. So it's uh, there's also a replay bug in this, as you can see. And here comes the back, and we're gonna take down this guy. Now, through two and a half minutes into the game, 2,700 damage, in one kill. I was like, ah, I'm gonna get more aggressive in the north. And I was like, wait a minute. No, nah, bad idea. So we're gonna back up here. Just back it on up. One great thing about this tank is the reverse speed. This tank has a ridiculous reverse speed. Uh, you might be wondering why I'm shooting at the turret of a T30. Um, and I, I don't like to give this information to anyone. Uh, the roof of the T30 kind of fucking sucks. Uh, Especially if you have a 122 millimeter gun or higher, uh, you can go through the roof of the sea like pretty much every time. Uh, you do have to hit it, however, um, which I am not doing currently. <laughs> so uh, I don't get my 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 lovely roof pen on this D30. I don't believe. I think he just overextends and I shoot him in the hole. But now I'm in a bit of a pickle. My team has won the north, so do I push with them, or do I hold in this position where they cannot spot me from the south, even if they push out into the open, because of what I'm about to do here. This 113 is playing super passively, until he isn't, and he will be punished for it. Not very hard, though. Let me see a tortoise. We see a 268 version 4. And this is kind of where the DPM of this tank just kind of let me down. Even though it's really good. I guess it's not that great for a TD. If I was in like a Sturvier, I could have uh, tracked the 2684. Uh, the tortoise wouldn't have gotten out of the way. Um, I don't die. Be a lot cleaner game. No, the replay bug's gone. What the heck is going on with this guy? 
We finally smacked the T-30 turret, but he had, he had it turned to the side, so... It is what it is. We're up to 5,200 damage here, and I'm at this point I'm thinking, that's a lot of hit points left. This could be a damage record for me. And then I refuse to play aggressively here when uh, all that's left is getting damage, so... Yep. This is not going to be a damage record, by the way, which is unfortunate. It might be the damage record in the SB2 for me. As I only have like 40 or 50 games played in it. See, one thing uh, about my account is that many years ago, I don't know why I'm trying to take this pixel shot at a T30. Um, many years ago, I got 7.4k or 7.3k damage in an IS4 on this very map. Um, I've hated this map for years, by the way. Like I used to, this used to be my least favorite map. But it was also the map that I got my damage record on, so I was like, oh. <laughs> This is a great map. I love this map. No, I don't really care that much for this map. But yeah, it was in the IS-4. And uh, I haven't topped that since. I've become a much better player, but I haven't topped it since. Anyway, I'll see you guys back in the garage. And here we go. Okay, so. We got two, 6,249 damage with two kills. Netting is a high caliber. Um, 71 spotting damage. Nice. Um, nine crits, which is crazy. Because I only pinned 10 shots. <laughs> Most of my damage was done from long range, but I missed so many shots that it doesn't really matter. Uh, this gun likes to troll you. Uh, me and this 140 kind of carried this game, it would appear. Uh, with the T30 and the Char 4, like, doing some decent help, and then this guy kind of went off, so, congrats, dude. Uh, that's a really good game for that tank. Uh, AE Phase 1 kind of went off, too, actually. You know what? This was just a really good team. Uh, this is a top-heavy team, uh, but it was a good top-heavy team. Um, this 140 had a heck of a game. That's, that's definitely an ace tanker. Um... Or, no, that's probably not an ace tanker. Never mind. Uh, the T30 had a decent enough game. Um, Char Future had a decent enough game. This guy had a really good game for this tank. I mean, the G Source, okay. It's no mana core, but, you know, nobody nobody did as much damage as I did. So, this is going to be my game of the week. Uh, as you can see, uh, this tank is not cheap to play the way I play it anyway. Um, because obviously I'm going to fire all gold out of my premium tier 10, or my reward tier 10 tank destroyer that I got from playing ranked. This is why it has the ranked camo on it, by the way. <coughs> and as you can see, uh, yeah. My mark is still the same, and I got a 6,000 damage gain in this tank, so. Mark's a little difficult to get in this thing. Anyway. Uh, that's gonna do it for me, I think. Um, yeah. So. I'll see you guys next time. Oh, boo, boo.